Coach, uh, you know, tight ball game. You were able to pull away in the second half. But what does it say about your depth when your, you know, two real scores didn't have what you would call uh, scoring nights, and your depth really came through and was able to pick up the slack? Yeah, it, it's a blessing to have um, the guys available that can come in and produce right away. I thought Najee was he was really good tonight. Getting Trey back was huge for us. Um, we can see where where that's gonna end up going with his shooting and Z, CJ, BI, their playmaking ability. Um, but it's a luxury to have for sure. Yeah, you talked about Trey and look, he took 10 attempts from this. And you could tell the adrenaline was racing a little yeah. bit early on, but once he settled down, he looked like the old Trey again. He did, he's been working his tail off him and coach Corey Brewer uh, and the medical staff, they've been working to get him back. He's been doing everything that he's supposed to do um, and more. And he's been itching to get on the floor. so. Great to have him back tonight. He looked he looked pretty solid to, for his first game, and um, it was fun. You know, that's a tough team. We knew that they were going to come out and play tough, especially in the first half off of back to back. And sometimes those games can be tough, um, but we did what we needed to do in the, in the second half to win the game, and that's the important part for us. I think Zion assisted Trey on three of his threes. Just what do you think about the way those guys fit together offensively? Yeah, they they have you know really good synergy. And um, it's been there since last season. You know, those two playing together, playing off each other, and they read and react. And that's what Z is looking for. He's looking for guys that he can pitch the ball to, they can shoot, they can drive, they can get it back to him, set screens, he can get downhill. Really good two-man game by, by those guys. Uh, JV kind of led the way in the first half. Just what do you think about his night? JV, JV's been great. Um, he dominated tonight, and we needed it. Uh, 24 points, 12 rebounds. You know, they didn't have an answer for him in the paint. And um, his teammates were all looking for him. So it, it was great to see him have a, bit, a monster game like he did tonight. You can tell they're still figuring some things out. But how much did you kind of see the effect of having Hawk and Trey out there at the same time? Yeah, I, I think it's going to continue to get better and better. It was great to see, great to get a glimpse of what we can be. We still have to put some work in to, you know, move the pieces around and, and get guys on the floor get certain groups on the floor together, but with um, our ability to get to the paint and adding the shooting now, uh, it can make us dangerous offensively. Now we got to do a better job defensively. Uh, two quarters in the first half, 31 and 30, you know, we can do better in that area and rebounding the ball 50-50, but I think, you know, sky's the limit for us offensively once we get healthy. Yeah, we're going to talk a lot about the, that shooting that Trey has, but how much does that added length and athleticism add to the defensive end as well? It's huge for us. Um, you know, it, it, look, it's good to get Trey Murphy back on the floor. Uh, he was, he's was been a big part of our success the last two seasons. Um, so we all were rallying for him to get on the floor and, and for him to get back. And it's, it's like he didn't miss a beat almost. So that was good to see. And now it's about continuing to build that chemistry with, with everybody on the team. Like I said, it's going to be some good problems to have. Um, you know, we'll have some guys that probably don't play as much, but, you know, they'll be ready. Just to kind of follow up on the next man up mentality, uh, is Trey expected to be available tomorrow night? Uh, we don't know yet. And Coach, uh, there at the end, it looked like Najee, 18 minutes, 10 points, 6 rebounds. Something, uh, his shooting, it looked like maybe it was a streak, but not something you can really depend on. He hit the dagger tonight. Can you just talk about what he did as, in that supporting role for 18 minutes just to make sure that everybody stayed connected? Yeah, I, I mentioned it earlier. Uh, Naj was great. Um, he came in and brought energy right away. Like you said, he rebounded the ball. Uh, he, he went after 50-50 balls. Um, he hit a couple big shots for us. And, you know, he just played under control the whole night and, and on both ends of the floor. And, and that's what he's capable of doing. Okay, thank you guys.